Hey cloggers, it's me, Brian Vaughn. Welcome back to Bry Clogger, the YouTube channel for great clogging content, including contests, guest instructors, performance, instruction videos, all sorts of great stuff. You guys. We have a first, we have a special guest workshop instructor, uh, Sarah Dwight Gilroy from up in the San Francisco area. I've been popping in and out of her class during pandemic and she's a great teacher and she's a lot of fun. So she wrote us uh, an intermediate dance just for this channel just for this channel so check it out you guys and make sure you subscribe to the channel right now click the bell for notifications for more great videos like this one from Sarah enjoy hello cloggers my name is Sarah Dwight Gilroy and I'm really excited to be here today as a guest instructor on Brian Bond's channel thank you Brian for asking me to do this I have an easy intermediate dance for you today. The song is called We Are Invincible, music by Tim Hurst, choreography by me. I'll teach it section by section. We'll get to dance each section with music, and then we'll dance it all together at the end. I'm gonna move a little bit quickly just because of the time limitations that we have here. Um, but remember, you can always rewind. You can also ask any questions you have in the comments, and I'll try to help you out. So we've got an intro section, we're going to wait 16, and then we have an intro section of two clog over vines. So we'll go to the left first, side, front, side, back, side, front, side, rock, step, and then we're going to clog over vine to the right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Let's just do that intro section, even though it's really only one step just so you can get a feel for the music. So wait 16 and then two clog over vines. Five, six, clog over. To the right. All right, our A section. We've got a Samantha. Samantha starts with a walkover, double step, double step, drag step, drag step, finish with a rock double. Let's do that all together. Five, six, Samantha, go. Rock double. Rebel brush is our next step. Rebel brush starts double step, double back. Tap behind and brush up. Left foot starts double step, double step, double back, tap up, brush up, leaving our right foot free. Let's try that rebel brush. Five, six, rebel brush, and a one, and a two, and three, and four. Our right foot's free for a break step. We're going to double step in front, little pause here, step back and kick, little pause here, and then step, rock, step to finish. So our count is and a one, two, three, and four. Let's try rebel brush and break step together. Five, six, rebel brush, break step. Okay, let's try those three steps together. Samantha, rebel brush, and break step. Five, Six, Samantha, go. Drag, step, drag, step, rock, double. Rebel brush, double step, double back, tap, break, step. Samantha, again. Rebel brush. Break, step. Let's go ahead and do it with the music. Here we go, five, six, Samantha. That was section A. Section B, we have only two steps in this section. We're going to start with a time step. 
start with a little pause and then you're going to stomp on the one. You're going to stomp, step, step, stomp, step, step, stomp. And your right foot's free at the end. Five, six, time, step, go, and stomp, step, step, stomp, step, step, stomp. And then a stomp double to finish the section. Stomp, double, step, double, step, rock, step. And that gets us back on our left foot. Let's do time step and stomp double together. And we're going to repeat that. We're going to do it two times. Five, six, time step, go, and one, and two, and three, and stomp double. Do it again. Time step, stomp double. Because both of these steps start on one and you have that little pause on and, you can clap on the and. So you can do and stomp. And then again, and stomp. That's how I like to do it usually. Let's do this section with music. Five, six, time step. Stomp double. Time step. Stomp double. All right, these are nice little short sections. The next section, we're on section C now. Three steps in this section. Kentucky basic is our first step. So we're gonna Kentucky drag over this way. Double step, drag, step. And I like to clap when I land. Um, and then the basic to finish your Kentucky basic. So Kentucky basic, ready, go. Double step, drag, step, and a basic. Our right foot will be free for two slur vines. Double step, slur step, and a basic. And then left, double step, slur step, and a basic. So that's two slur vines. And then we'll finish the section. We're gonna repeat, but we'll finish the first time through with a right foot joey. Double step, back, side, side, back, side, side. That switches our foot back to the left. So right foot Joey, five, six, Joey, go, double step, back, side, side, back, side, side. Let's try these three steps together. Kentucky basic, two slur vines, and a Joey. <clears throat> five, six, Kentucky basic, slur vine right, and left, right foot Joey, and then we will do it again from the Kentucky Basic. this dance. We have arrived at a new section, <coughs> section D. The music is a little bit more relaxed here, more relaxed sounding. We're going to keep the same pace, the same speed, but it's just a little bit quieter. We're going to do an eight count slur vine moving to the left. We have double step, slur step, double step, double step, double step, slur step, and a basic. So our first half is and a one, two, and a three, and a four. Our second half is a slur vine exactly, slur and basic. And then we're going to 
gonna do that eight count slur vine also to the right. So we have slur, two double steps, slur, and basic. Five, six, eight count slur vine. One, two, and a three, and a four. Five, six, and a seven, and eight. The only other step in this section is a cowboy, which is a triple brush moving forward. One, two, three, brush up, and then a rock back. Double step, rock step, rock step, rock step. We're gonna do two cowboys though, so we can turn these, and that is on the cue sheet as a turn. So when we do that triple brush, we're gonna turn it to the left. Five, six, cowboy, go, triple brush, turn, rock back. Do it again, cowboy, triple brush, turn, rock back. I don't have a lot of room here. You might not either at your house. <laughs> so make it as small as you need to. So this section was two eight count slur vines, a left and a right, and two cowboys. Turn both of them. Let's try this section, and then we've got one more little bit. Okay, our last section, section E. Two steps in this section. We have a heel toe vine four. Usually a heel toe vine is an eight count step. We're only gonna do the first half, which looks like this. Double step, heel step, double step, tap step. And that's it. We're not gonna go any further. So that makes four counts, five, Six, heel, toe, vine, four, and a one, and two, and a three, and four. So when you do this, hit your heel, don't put any weight on it, and then step down. After this double step, tap your toe. Don't put any weight on it, just tap it, and then step down. Five, six, heel, toe, vine, four, and a one, and two, and a three, and four. Mountain basic. Another step with a pause and then a stomp on one, we're gonna stomp double up and a basic. So again, if you wanna clap on the and, you can. And stomp double up and a basic. Let's try heel toe vine four and a mountain basic. Five, six, heel toe vine four, mountain basic. On that mountain basic, we're actually gonna turn it to the left, one quarter. Stomp double up and a basic. And then we're going to make a box. Heel toe vine four, mountain basic to face the back, and again and again, and we'll end up at the front. Let's try it three more times. Five, six, heel toe vine four, mountain basic, turn to the back. Heel toe vine four, mountain basic, turn. Heel toe vine four, mountain basic, turn. When we get finished with that box, we have four extra stomps. It's written as a break on the cue sheet. We're just gonna stomp one, two, three, four. And everything else in the dance is just repeating what we've done. So let's try this new box section. Here we go, five, six, heel toe, vine four. here because there's nothing else new. It's just repeating through to the end. The only th other thing you might need to know, you will need to know, is at the end we're going to do this Kentucky basic section, but we're going to have to cut it short. So do a Kentucky basic this way, two slur vines, just like usual, and then instead of finishing with a joey, this is the very end of the dance and the music just kind of peters out. 
So we're going to do one basic and kind of slow it down. And you'll have to hear it in the music. It's not one of those songs that just ends abruptly, unfortunately. So let's try dancing the whole thing. And remember, at any time you're watching this later, you can always go back and watch each section again and do it as many times as you want. And remember, if you have questions, just put them down in the comments there and I'll try to help you out. Here we go, five, six, clog over. guest instructor on his channel. I hope you had fun with this dance. I know I had fun teaching it. Thanks again. Bye. Hey there, great job, Sarah. I really enjoyed the dance. I can't wait to teach it to my students. I hope all of you in YouTube land enjoyed it too. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, click the bell for notifications, and check out Sarah's channel too, Loud Feet Dancer on YouTube. If you're interested in having Sarah teach at a workshop for you, I'll include her basic contact info in the description below. Have a great day, everybody. Don't forget to subscribe for more great clogging content.